Didn't say I was a kid. fishing carp fishing so yeah so uh, I'm do I do that now and I finish work this morning I'm off for four days I am heading south and I'm taking the fishing gear with me woohoo let's go and get some southern carp baby woohoo yes driving down there now is a beautiful day here in the Midlands in the UK I'm heading south so to what day is it? Monday. Tomorrow is going to be a nice southerly carp fishing day. Wet nets and tight lines, baby. Woo! Yeah! Services. Whisper time. Coffee time. Sandwich time. What have I got for fishing? What have I got for fishing? Boilies, I've got myself some boilies, I've got some mainline impact. I've got myself some pop-ups and I've soaked them. Oh. In some pineapple goo. What else have I got? Nah. Got me some different leads, I'm a bit short on leads, so I've got myself some different leads. I want to try something different as well, I've got three rods, I'm doing two carp. And we'll stick one on the float. So bag me some floats just to mix things up a little bit. And let's angle this down if I can. Secret rep weapon. Wiggly wiggly maggies. Wee! <laughs> I ain't put one of these in my mouth for ages. Since I was a kid. Huh? Wiggly wiggly. Maggity maggity. Ah, oh, that smell. I ain't smelled that smell since I was about 10 years old and I used to fish on the canal. So yeah. Uh, put the maggots and lids on, don't want them crawling around everywhere. Little Maggie Mag Maggies. Tomorrow is Southern Fried Fishing, baby. Catch you later. Catch you on the bank. Mm -hmm. Get hooked. Yeah. Is that what it's called? No, it's just with their effort. All you need to know before you go. There's a nice look around the lake, an excellent cafe. Further paths will take you through woodlands. Uh, Basically, he said Shearwater Lake. Fishing and angling, that's at Longleat. Oh, oh it, Longleat? it is Shearwater, yeah. Okay. It's fabulous, 36 acre lake, set in stunning scenery near Warminster. And there's a fishery very much on the up. Oh, right. right, okay, but so we're filming. And it's got a GPS cycle. Yeah. Oh. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> we haven't caught anything. It's dead here. No southern fried fishing today. No. So. Not yeah, so far, looking. anyway. But it was a bit chilly this morning. And if there's a slight frost, that can, that so can the anything, uh, make a then, difference. The only thing we can do is uh, yeah, strike one of these bad boys up. <laughs> when all else fails, let's reach for a cigar. So what are we smoking? Today we're smoking the Acid Blondie Cigar. Who is it by, babe? It's from the Drew Estate, it says, and it's, it's from the Havana House. And it retails at around sort of £9. It's handmade in Nicaragua with long fillers so it's very slow burning um 
and interestingly they cure it for months and months to truly develop the essential oils which apparently is something that the, all the acid cigars um, is, uh, is, is their experience so to speak this is what they do um, and apparently this is this is uh, some mild cigar but apparently they say it's, it's sweet give it a go so a mega sweet cigar and it's quite different oh my god just just do that oh my it is oh wow take a dry suck on it do you know what that's like oh wow that is really sweet isn't it it's that is like, almost like like harry bow in there it's like flowers mm. wow that doesn't even smell like a cigar doesn't even taste like a cigar no I don't know if that's though your fishing tackle. <laughs> the sweet, <laughs> fingers the sweetness boilers. off his fishy, of, of his uh, fishing tackle or the um, cigar yet. <laughs> Good hell! How sweet! Jesus! It's like yeah, sugar. Really? It does say that. It says. Um. It's a mega sweet cigar, something very different. Wow, it's like it's been dipped in, su in mm. sugar, babe. Is it? That is very different, isn't it? Very, it's like it's been dipped in sugar. My lips are really sugary. That is, that is. That is smooth. It is it has got a, 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 a sweetness. That's interesting. Because you don't really expect that from a cigar, do you really? No, it's a very you nice cigar. You expect like the, um, the chocolatey notes and the coffee notes and oaky and... But that's very... That's very um, which makes it interesting because that would make for an interesting smoke after, after a, a lovely dinner and a dessert. So maybe with a, um, it's a like, sweet drink. It's like the foot of the cigar. It's been dipped in sugar. nice. Does it tell you the, uh, the size, babe, and the ring gauge? It didn't. So not, four not and a half, not about four to four and a half inch, with probably around about a 30, about a 34 ring gauge on that by the looks on it. Oh, okay. What does it tell you about the wrapper and the, the binder and everything now? It doesn't. Not it really doesn't. done our own work on this one because we're out fishing. We are, we're, we're out and about, and it hasn't said a lot, only that they, they are quite a unique experience, the, all of the acid cigars, and it has got acid written on across the label, mm. and it is quite sweet. Yeah. So I'm fishing on my two carp rods. Uh, I've just put my line straight into the tree, which is probably about 50, 50 yards away, yeah. 40 yards away, if that. Luckily, I've got it back. I've had to set up a new rig. And uh, while I casted that, my, that in, I went over to the other side and managed to get it back, climbing up trees, getting a branch and ferreting. Luckily, I got it back. And Alex is fishing on the float. Not that it's going anywhere today, so it has it's been... It's definitely floating. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's definitely floating, but I want to see it go under. <laughs> yeah, try some. I want to see it... Uh, I'll, I'll have some more in a minute, darling. I, I want to see it bobbing up and down with, with, with a fish at the end. <laughs> so, yeah, day off work, and um, thought I'd accompany Matty fishing. I do... I love the countryside, I love being outside... Um, obviously, you know, the time of year, it's, it's 
it's spring is coming so it's getting nice isn't mm. it it's definitely going to make for a much warmer afternoon I'll put so, it while i'm fishing i'm sitting here doing nothing with my t-shirt on so yeah warm enough it's warm enough well you've been climbing trees and stuff yeah and i haven't really sat down that much because i've been ferreting around yeah yeah yeah. Keeping myself busy. You can see the set of my fingers. I've got boily juice all over them. Looks like I've been smoking cigarettes for 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, which hopefully that isn't what's what's making the cigar sweet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah. It's funny because I put my hands all over. It's got uh, boily juice on it. <laughs> probably pineapple leaks. I've got pineapple. I've doused them all in pineapple. Maybe that's what's making. Yeah, ma there you are, see. I um, see. There you are, see. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> you and I are. See. You are. Well, you said see. that earlier as well, didn't you? With your, with your, your you know, you know, it's like, you know. Was it you know? What did you say? And I. And I. And I. I've been setting up rods, and I. And I. <laughs> Don't mean haven't I? Is that and I? And I. <laughs> yeah, that's where, you know, from the Midlands, you're like, N-I, A-I, I day to that, I day. So I didn't do that, but we say, we day, we day to that, we day. Not so much where I'm from, but a bit, little bit further up Wolverhampton way. Yeah, I bet. Mm? Yeah. Mm, thanks very much. It's quite, it's, nice. it's, it's quite nice smoke. It's smooth, well, isn't it? It's very light. It's very uh, sweet. Very sugary. Well, it is. It is the the blondie. Yeah, but I didn't realise it would um, give you such a sugary note on your lips. Mm. Like you've just um, had a, one of those sugar cubes on your lips. If 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 you haven't tried it, guys, I'd say try it because it's it is an experience. Would I want this in a cigar? Now and again, why not? All the time? No. No. I like the traditional flavoured cigars. You know, the, the coffee, the chocolate, uh, the kind of like hay, cedar, earthy. Yeah. I like yeah. that. The... Yeah. The deep, the sort of like the, the deep flavours mm. that we've tried. Yeah. That is that is different. But it's nice if you want something lighter and you want to have something, you know, um, maybe with a, with a dessert wine, maybe with a, a Bailey's. Which is quite um, a sweet drink. It's like an Irish cream. Um, that would go down nicely, I think, with that yeah, cigar, it would, wouldn't it? it? Yeah, definitely. Very sugary. Very sugary. Mm. So, yeah, very nice. So it's, it's the Drew Estate Tacid Blondie. It is. And it's about, it's around nine pounds. UK. So, mm. Which is sort of like, um, I don't know, is, is that the cheaper end of cigars? I mean, obviously, it, seems I, it, to obviously be a, it must be. For the seems, average person on In the UK, about. yeah, you're looking at, yeah, that's about. I think you, if you go any cheaper than that, you are getting sort of pretty, they're quite ropey after that. Oh, Things yeah. are around about three to five pounds, they're a little bit ropey. But what I've learnt so far, I wish those ducks would knob off. What if they think we've got food for them? Probably. We've got a tub full of maggots there. Mm. <laughs> it's a fairly quick burn lot. I'm nearly. Uh... Which is interesting because it actually said it's it's a slow burning cigar. Drew Estate, the rebirth of cigars. Mm. Mm. Quite a statement, isn't it? That is quite a statement, isn't it? Yeah. No, yeah, I'm fine, thank you. So, that did say it was really slow burning, and it's not particularly. And mind you, I'm not exactly a slow smoker. No, that's true. But it's smooth, it's light, it's tasty. Matty certainly does, he loves his... He loves his cigars now, don't you? I do. Chills me out. Chills me out even more now, I'm fishing. 
<laughs> you couldn't get more chilled out there really, could you today? I know, you get any more chilled, we'd be getting icicles on the end of our nose. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> but it's not, there's no coffee note in this, is there? No chocolate note, no, no earthy note. It's kind of, what do you reckon? A dessert cigar. Yeah. A dessert cigar. Yeah, good, good one, that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Like, almost like a, a fudge sundae. Caramel yeah, sundae. And have it afterwards. Yeah. Definitely. Starting to canoe slightly now. See, how it, see if it brings it back. Any more? No, I'm fine. You know I'm here to have the odd taste. I think I have my favourite so far. I think there was one with a couple of times ago, wasn't it? Which one? It was quite a chocolatey one. Very smooth. I like them very smooth. Yes, yeah, so if you haven't seen our video, this is the first time you've seen our video. We've done quite a few now. Mm. Um, doing the cigar journey from total beginner to hopefully a seasoned, I won't even say a pro, but more... Experienced. Seasoned, experienced cigar smoke. <laughs> Fair enough. Mm, yeah. Like and subscribe. Yes. Ask us any questions. Yeah, comment and we'll reply. Always. Definitely. Yeah. So, what's it coming? We're going to knock it off now? Yeah, probably. Enjoy. Try and do another cast. Going to crack on with some fishing. Try and catch them for some dinner. Yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know about that, but yeah. But we'll see you soon. See you later, guys. Take care, yeah? Cigar moments, everyone out.